what's up guys welcome back to another video of clash royale and as you can see we got some exciting news in our, in this video and uh, yeah I'm a bit disappointed that I couldn't push to let arena 4 to actually uh, open up a possibility to get a lava hound in the um, fr from the super magical chest that we've got to open which is a free super magical chest we got it in a battle and I tweeted it out uh, a couple of days ago which is pretty awesome it's like how much is that that's like what 2500 gems that's like 14 pounds at the moment and uh, yeah it's pretty cool and hopefully we can get we can get something nice in this chest and yeah I've been trying to push to actually get you to get us to arena 4 uh, arena 4 to get better troops for our chest opening but unfortunately I couldn't do it because the, 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 the opponents are just too good and um, yeah I thought of okay let's actually level up and uh, well we're gonna open up some chests now we're gonna level up uh, make a clan for you to for you guys to join and have some friendlies with me if you want want, want to and uh, go into a life battle and this should be a nice episode of actually opening a super magical chest uh, okay let's let's start with a free chest which could be pretty awesome hopefully and uh, we got some gold some cannons and goblin uh, oh yeah I did play um, I did play by, on, by not recording, like I said, I was trying to push, and I started to use the um, spawner deck, and at some points, it act, it, it's just crazy, spawner deck, sometimes, even though I did try with my high, uh, well, with my main account, it didn't really work, but with this account, with the lower accounts, people don't know how to deal with them, they just try and fight through the spawners that keep spawning and spawning and spawning and it just destroys them uh, especially a, a double elixir time so try it out if you if you want you want to and uh, maybe you're gonna like it maybe it's gonna work for you and you might trophy push with a spawner deck okay let's open up this gold chest see, see what we get and then uh, leave the best for the last I, sh uh, I should say and we got some gold three cannons four barbarians one giant and nine spear goblins okay it's time to actually open the super magical chest and uh, let's get the drums going um okay let's open the deck. we're gonna get uh 300 cards oh my goodness 10 epics 61 rares we're gonna we can upgrade loads of cards but we, we stay i'm gonna try and stay as a level three uh for as long as possible and uh i, I want to trophy push and maybe get to 2000 trophies as a level 3 so we're gonna use one deck and only upgrade those cards in that deck so um, yeah let's open this super magical chest 1900 gold that's gonna help us out uh, nine tom tombstones okay a balloon okay okay that's gonna help us out to put push because the balloon is, is, is so strong in lower levels because there's not a lot of troops that actually uh, attack air troops which is just overpowered and strong um 25 fireballs okay 27 rockets not the best uh 234 goblins that could be upgraded to like what level six or well, just pretty cool uh four princes okay and that was the last epic Six baby dragons. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. That's pretty awesome to be honest um, Yeah, the prince is prince is strong So I'm thinking of using this prince obviously use the balloon I'm gonna try to use the balloon instead of the witch and I might use the witch instead of the musketeer because the musk uh, the witch does splash damage even though the uh, the baby dragon does plus splash, splash, splash damage as well I'm gonna keep that witch in there because she's she's strong and uh, yeah I'm gonna upgrade my baby dragon to level two because 
it helps out and then I'm going I'm thinking of grading him to level there you go we're leveled up I'm just gonna screenshot that just to for personal purposes and you know just to have us something nice to have in in the future and yeah level three and uh, I'm gonna upgrade the cannon because we need to have that uh, we can upgrade quite a few things in this deck now and I'm just gonna upgrade the arrows because the arrows don't do any damage to uh, the minions so let's we just need to watch the XP uh, so we not so we don't level up and uh, we need to make sure when I make a clan I'm, I, won't, I won't donate and um, I'm really sorry about that guys but um, I don't want to level up at this point and hopefully we can actually get some uh, you know we can actually push and be one of the highest level threes in oh my god I just did that oh my god I just got a uh, just level four okay that's, that's a fail but Level four, we're gonna stay as a level four, <laughs> and I, that's twice I did that now. But oh well, it don't matter. And yeah, let's let's be a level four. I think a level four is quite a reasonable number, and we can actually like you know upgrade a uh, a few more things and uh, actually push nicely with this sort of deck. And uh, yeah, the archers give us ten XP, the bomber gives six XP and the cannon give us 6 xp as well and 10 x so we got a decent deck now going on and um yeah this should be pretty awesome uh we're level four we, we need some couple more coins to actually create a clan uh i might join uh a clan or something early uh, Leave a comment down below if you want me to join a clan and I'll do it and I'll, I'll come and say hello and we'll play some friendly battles. So, yeah. I've failed to completely to actually stay as a level 3, but that's fine. We can be a level 4. And, uh, yeah, that's twice I did that, like I said, in, in, in other videos. But, okay, that's fine. Let's get into a battle and then uh, wrap this up. And, yeah. So... We're playing against Z from this clan, and yeah, let's use the balloon for the first time. I'm not going to use it now. I'm just going to wait. Let's see what he does. And um, uh, actually, uh, try and counter him first, and then counter push back with uh, a nice set of troops. Uh, okay, he's got a giant skelly coming towards us, which is which is not going to be good because the archer is distracting him, and he might even touch a tower okay he didn't he didn't touch a tower or the witch which is good and now I'm just gonna put the giant to distract the prince uh, and to soak up the damage so which is pretty good um, because the baby dragon would have doesn't distract him so uh, he would have went straight to our tower and did a lot of damage because baby dragon doesn't do a lot of damage as well so um, yeah the Valkyrie is gonna do a little bit of damage but not too bad so I'm gonna counter with a baby dragon. He's, he still doesn't know we got balloons, so we're gonna keep it for the best. So we're gonna keep it for last and for the best, and hopefully we can uh, actually get something out of out of it. But um, yeah, the baby dragon is gonna do some some work to that tower. I'm gonna put some archers to actually help out, which wasn't really needed, I don't think. But uh, the archers gonna split up, and hopefully uh, one of them died. But okay, that's fine. I'm gonna put witch because she's gonna spawn some skeletons. That gonna distract the prince and then the bomber to actually distract the distract the prince even more, which wasn't the best counter I should say because I've I've used quite a lot but we still got a witch coming towards this right hand side tower with the baby dragon to to tank for her and uh, yeah he puts the Valkyrie down which is a great counter for the witch and the witch can't do anything but the baby dra dragon is gonna take out the Valkyrie and gonna go towards his tower and do some more. Uh, damage he's gonna just get rid of those minions out of the way and uh, yeah I'm gonna just leave I'm gonna put giant at the back and uh, see how he responds and then gonna uh, just put cannon to um, and some archers to distract this giant skelly towards us and uh, yeah I'm gonna arrow everything 
there just to get rid of that and yeah that was a pretty nice uh, counter we got a giant on the right hand side coming towards this right hand side tower and then we got another giant coming on the left coming towards this right, left hand side tower and then a balloon on, on the left as well because he used minions on the right hand side uh, he's gonna struggle to actually counter uh, my left hand side push and the baby dragon's gonna get, get rid of these minions and the, the left hand side tower is down because nobody can counter the balloon at this stage and we're even going to take a two crown victory and just going to distract this prince from attacking that right hand side tower and that was pretty easy and pretty well played I should say and yeah first win I'm going to go into another battle because I had so much fun in playing with this deck with this uh, actually upgraded deck and uh, it's pretty strong I think for level 4 it's actually pretty strong obviously we got super magical chest which helps us out a lot and uh, yeah we just need to make sure we're going to collect the I'm, not, I'm I'm gonna leave the achievements. I'm just gonna leave it. Uh, I know the not notification is gonna annoy me, but that's fine. So okay, let's go into our last battle and try and get this last uh, chest slot filled in. And we're playing against William Kong from SDWD Squad. He's at 934 trophies, and he's a level six. So okay. We might struggle a little bit, but we beat a level 6 with our level 2 uh, troops, so maybe we should be fine. We should be fine. So I'm going to put a giant again to, to distract the prince, and just because then I had no one to counter the prince. So uh, the prince is strong, and um, now the prince actually survived, which is a shame, but um, we got a baby, level 3 baby dragon against a level 1 baby dragon. And uh, the baby dragon is going to do just fine with those archers supporting him at the back. So we've got baby dragon going towards his right hand side tower and some archers. But uh, he's put some musketeer which distracts our baby dragon and those archers and gets rid of him quite easily. Uh, he does have a goblin hut going. And I'm just going to arrow those minions because they can do a lot of work to um, our right hand side tower. And we're just going to put a witch and distract it with a cannon because the balloon is strong and he could have actually done some he might do some damage now to be honest and uh, now we, we actually managed to get it uh, distracted quite well and uh, get rid of him quite easily so okay we need to do something about this goblin hill on the left hand side because I think he that's the, the actual tower is going for uh, he's just doing chip damage I'm gonna put baby dragon on the right hand side and then a, a, dra a, a giant on the right hand side as well. And then uh, he's going to put a Walkree down. I'm going to put some archers down to actually uh, get rid of this Walkree hopefully. And uh, yeah, the minion's going to do work. But I'm going to arrow those minions and the Walkree. And the baby dragon should get to the tower with those archers. Uh, tanking for the archers and do a lot of damage on the right hand side of the, t uh, of the map. Which we might, they might even take it out to be honest. Yep, they took it out, which is great. And now it's gonna uh, defend with a cannon, distracting um, the goblins coming towards us. And the prince is actually uh, gonna pretty much near nearly get to the tower. So um, we got pretty lucky there. I'm just gonna put I put a witch down on the right hand side and a baby dragon to count the baby dragon. I still haven't showed a balloon. I don't think so. Uh, the, this is the right time. Use the lightning, so he's got, he must be low on the elixir. So we got a big push coming on the on the left hand side. Gonna arrow everything there, and uh, the left hand side tower should be down as well, because no one's the balloon is at full health, and um, yep, he, he he managed to get three shots, which is easily a tower down, and yeah, we managed to get rid of that balloon as well, and there's a prince coming on the left hand side, which shouldn't be a problem to counter. And it's another win for us. I think now we leveled up to level four, it could be very easy to actually push uh, because it's, I, f I found it easy to push with a, a level two um, account. Well, being a level two, I should say. And then uh, I think being as a level four with level five commons and uh, a level three baby dragon. It's gonna help us out a lot. Anyways, guys, it's been your boy PNT Gaming. I hope you like this this uh, series. Uh, if you do, please press that like button. Let's get 10 likes for in this video. And if you're new here, please subscribe. Peace.